president at the Kenya Institute of Mass Communication. I take broadcast journalism and also I am an actress in both. IGs, motherfuckers stay free every day. Yeah. Fuck with them, you better run off. No sky dive, it's gonna jump off. No punt attendant, hoes offended. Cause they see we fly a thin flight attendant. Do a hair flip, then I dip. Alright, alright. Welcome back to Daily Wheels TV show. So guys, so I know a lot of you have been asking that they need to see uh, the show actually being influenced by some top celebrities. So for the first time uh, in this show, I'm actually bringing out one of the people who are who like they are known with like around like 50,000 people or 50,000 people know this celebrity that is coming. Okay, can I call it? She's not a celebrity, yeah, but I think she is. Yeah, okay. If you are new to this show, I'm Guta Wills, and make sure to subscribe to our channel. Don't forget to like this video, guys. Share it around. YouTube hides our video, so I want you, when you're watching this video first, click the subscribe, click the click the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up, guys. Cause it's actually an interview with Aziad. You know Aziad. Aziad, it, for those who don't know Aziad, Aziad is this chick who actually uh, made major Utawezana, major versus one Utawezana song to actually be known by so many people. <laughs> so today I have uh, I have her on the show. We will be talking to her. I have some questions that you guys have been have posted on my Instagram page and our Facebook page and also on WhatsApp page. So if you're not yet in our if you're not yet in our WhatsApp group guys please drop your numbers on the comment section. I wanna add you on our daily episode TV WhatsApp group. Let's bring Aziad on the show. Aziad 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 Can you can you hear me Aziad? Okay. Aziad. Can you can you hear me Aziad? Okay, okay. So Aziad, welcome to the show. Uh, this is the Day Louis show, and I have some questions that people have been calling me, telling me that I should ask you this. So I hope you will be kind enough to answer it for us. Okay, okay. The first question: What influenced you to do the song with Aziad? Um, I do TikTok, TikToks and video every single time, and. Whenever a song, I, whenever I feel like I vibe to the song and the song beats are dope, I just hop onto the challenge. Yeah, I just did it as I normally yeah, do on my TikToks. All right. The second question is: uh, Tell us more about yourself. Tell, tell us more about what, what should we know about Aziad more. I mean, tell us about your education. What do you do? Um, do you I'm a media student at the Kenya Institute of Mass Communication. I take broadcast journalism and also I am an actress in both theatre and film and also a content creator. So, which year are you in? I mean, in the university? What year? Which year are you in the university? I'm supposed to go back in May upgrading broadcast journalism, so second year. Okay, I know that. Okay, now to the most critical part of it. I know that you did this song with Awezana and you danced it very, very well. And a lot of people have actually praised you, but there are also some people who have actually hated you. So, what is your reaction to these haters? This First of all, um, it really got to me, and I was wondering, like, I didn't, I didn't harm anyone, neither did I kill anyone. So why would anyone hate on me? You know, I've not wronged anyone. I was just doing what I do every single time, just doing my videos. So I was shocked, and it really got to me. I just didn't understand why, where the, all the hate was coming. From. All right, all right. And how, how, how do you deal with these haters? How do you deal with these haters? Haters? How do you deal with them? At first, um, I, I won't deny it was hard, and I actually sobbed a little, not a little bit, a lot, but after talking to my manager, Peter Kawa, and my close friends, and actually what I'm really grateful for was that the support came in very fast, the hashtag I stand with as yet when I saw it on Twitter. So that was really encouraging, and it really gave me hope, and really, I was able to put the smile back on my face because I felt like I wasn't alone and people were there. But come your support and get a clone kukuja to get a different story right now. Has Femi one has Femi one talked to you? Has Femi one talked to you? Yes, she has reached out to me. 
uh, I hear rumors that Femi One did actually contact you and she talked to you. So how did you feel when Femi One actually talked to you? I have never talked to her before and that made me feel great because it was a pleasure and I was really humbled to be able to push the song in the way that I could, just creating a challenge. If that meant much to her, then I was so grateful and I was humbled that it meant something. All right, Azia, thank you so much for joining us on this Daily Wheels TV show. Uh, uh, we hope that you get to be successful on your future endeavors and it has been nice to host you on this show and until next time it's beautiful all right to you subscribers welcome back to daily episode tv if you have, if you haven't yet subscribed subscribe and join the family we are at almost 1500 subscribers for those who are wondering and uh, subscribe so that we get to 2k and we continue the show thank you so much for watching and be sure to like this video i've been your host peter wills until next time see you in the next episode of daily wills tv show Subscribe and I'll see you on the next episode of Daily Episode TV.